In this tutorial, we are going to analyze YouTube comments using LangChain. So we are going to do two main tasks in this tutorial. One, to get YouTube comments from the video and then pass those comments to LangChain model in order to get the summary of those comments. So in order to extract YouTube comments from YouTube video, we are going to use the YouTube API. So just go to console.google.com so let's create a new project a recent oh yeah new project and just give the project a name and organization no organization and create this project okay so our project has been created successfully so let's select this project go to apis and here as you can see we don't have youtube api so we need to go to library and from library we need to select our youtube data api v3 so let's select this api and enable this youtube api so our api has been enabled successfully go to enabled apis and services now you will see youtube data api right here let's click uh, go to credentials and create credentials it's going to be api key and let's copy this api close it and we are good to go now it's time to use this api key in order to extract youtube comments let me save youtube api in the api key variable we are going to ask user to enter the video id and for this tutorial i'm going to use a static id so just go to any video and this is going to be the youtube id let's copy this id and paste it right here uh, so we are going to use the request module of python so we need to define our endpoint along with some parameters so the endpoint is going to be www.googleapis.com slash youtube slash v3 and comment thread so this is going to be the endpoint and now let's define our parameters so we are going to extract the YouTube comments, which is a part of the snippet object of YouTube API. So let's define those parameters here. So part and that is going to be snippet. So snippet contains all the basic information uh, regarding the YouTube video, such as the title, description, comment, likes, dislike, etc. And then we need to define the video ID and it's going to be video ID and the key it's going to be API key finally how many comments we want to extract so just type here max results uh, obviously you can change this value and it's time to send our get request import our request module and let's type here response is equals to requests dot get or uh, define the endpoint along with the parameters convert the response to JSON and finally let's print data test it out uh, our API and everything is working fine but the results are very weird so I tread on these items one by one and let's print these items so uh, here is our snippet and inside snippet we have some information and yeah uh, we got our top level comment inside top level comment we have the text display and this is the original comment so we need to extract this part so we need to go to snippet then inside snippet top level comments and then text display so let's write here comment is equals to item then snippet inside snippet top level comment and inside top level comment uh, we need to extract text display so this is going to be the comment and now let's print this comment wow we got error uh, text display uh, sorry 
uh, here we need to also uh, move to snippets and then text display and I hope this time we will get our comments yes we got them so we got all bunch of comments and let's save all of these comments in a string variable so that we could pass it later to the uh, Langchain model for summarization. So we have done our first part. We are now successfully extracting YouTube comments based on the ID of the YouTube video. It's time to pass these comments to our language model. So let's import language model from template and the chain. So initialize the LLM model and we are going to use the chat GPT 3.5 turbo version. So model is equals to set up our open AI key. So I have defined the key in this file. Uh, let's import that function and let's type get key which will return our open AI key. So we have key, we have model and it's time to create our prompt template. Template is equals to and let's tell our model that you need to summarize all of these YouTube comments. So we are telling him that give me the summary of the following YouTube comments and let's pass this template to our prompt template. Prompt template is equals to prompt template. The input variables are comments and the template is equals to template. And let's change this prompt template with the LLM model define the model which is going to be LLM and the prompt which is going to be the prompt template and it's time to check our model chain.run and let's pass these comments and let's run I hope this is going to work fine and yes we got our summary so you can read them it's very comprehensive summary I think so I wasn't expecting this type of uh, summary but yeah our model is working fine and everything is good so I hope uh, you have enjoyed this tutorial and obviously you can ask user to enter the YouTube ID and I'll see you in the next video bye bye